hi welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle today I'm going to be doing a, a Travel News UK 5 exciting new facts at part 3 July 2021 so uh, let's jump right into it if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe it's the red and white subscription button also click my, the notification bell I upload five times a week on both my travel and lifestyle channel and um, also click the join button to join my memberships for just 99 pence per month uh, for um, a lot of extra perks so um, let's jump right into it first we've got uh, the Guardian newspaper saying Wales and Columbia are the top um, UK uh, U UK locations uh, for um, summer holidays um, so um, Cornwall and Devon um, have been overtaken as 62% uh, percent of Britons plan to take their main holiday in the UK this year to uh, Columbia and uh, Wales so wow that's uh, really interesting different trends again not all going uh, down south but um, going to Wales and Columbia wow um, number two um, the Guardian um, it says house party 15 extraordinary UK holiday properties uh, for group vacation from magnificent Scottish castle to a medieval manor in Kent swanky pads uh, to have fun with family and friends wow that's really interesting um to know, uh, to know so anybody that fa uh, fancies um a very different holiday like um staying in a castle or a manor house um or just something different in general then again um check the guardian um uh, newspaper out um that's uh for more information um number three the telegraph uh, newspaper travel news latest Heathrow um, basically chaos as 120 security staff are told to isolate Heathrow passengers um, departure clues um, are up to 2.5 our hours of waiting yesterday that's a long time um again i personally would only go abroad at the moment um, um unless you uh, you know have to um but that is my opinion to avoid um all these cues and you know at further chaos in my opinion I, I would stick to UK destinations and number four Scottish airports call uh, for a relaxation of quarantine rules Scotland airports want the same exemptions for vaccinated travellers as those are planned in England so again good luck with that and at last but not least the BBC News say the government has said bus and train coach companies etc transport companies must decide whether passengers have have to wear face coverings on their service when covid rules are relaxed which is going to be this monday coming 
um, the 19th of July, uh, which is supposed to be Freedom Day. Um, but those rules are replaced with the government guidance advising passengers to wear masks um, on busy surfaces or only on busy surfaces. Health Secretary Savage Javad, excuse my pronunciation, said masks would still be recommended on public transport, but those without a mask or a face covering would no longer be fined on the 19th of July. Nevertheless, Bosch and train companies, etc., would still be able to turn away passengers who refuse to wear one unless they are exempt. Again, I would still recommend taking your mask again, especially if you're in a crowded place or going to be visiting a crowded place. I mean, not only protects yourself, but it also protects other people around you and obviously your loved ones as well um, um, especially if it's a busy service so i would like to say thank you for watching and i'll see you tomorrow um, and tomorrow's video is going to be travel news europe five exciting new facts part three july or part four July 2021 so I hope everybody has a as good night and as good day as possible and um, I hope everybody is well and bye for now thank you bye